Hey guys, I'm Pistol101 and welcome back to Dying Light the Following. So, as I said in the last part, I thought we were going to be doing some side quests this go around, but I was running around, you know, doing whatever, and then a main quest popped up at the end of the tunnel. So, that's pretty appropriate as you can see considering we have 90% of the story left on the top right corner of the screen, right there. And uh, it's pretty appropriately named at the end of the tunnel. This may be the last or maybe even the second last main story of the game. So we really are getting pretty close. I'm glad it popped up because it wasn't there last time. The Faceless received information about a group of bandits matching the description I gave them. So Rise's men really are somewhere around here. They probably occupied the granary. I have to head there and see if they've captured one of the Faceless. Brother Orkin. Shout out to Orca the Whale, you know. The guy's Brother Orkin. I don't know what he's going at there. It's a dumb name. Anyways, yeah, I went to the granary, that was my objective, and then I got here, and it changed to find Brother Orkin. So, I guess we gotta find our way in here. Brother Orkin got captured like a bitch. As you remember, I believe in part 5, we investigated a military convoy in a cave, and all of the drugs were stolen, and most of the people were dead. So, I'm assuming they kidnapped Brother Orkin, and now we, we know where he is. Apparently, he's here somewhere. Brother Orkin, where are you at? Oh, they took him in a white van with no back windows. Ha <laughs> ha, classic. Classic brother work and getting stolen in white vans with no windows. Alright. Oh god, oh god, why? I did that thing and it just like made me fly over. Oh, hey, who are you? Are you bad? Oh, you're bad. You're bad. Oh, you're bad. Oh, he took out so much of my health. Oh my god. That was quick. He took out a hundred of my health very quickly. I'm gonna have to switch to my assault rifle here. Hold on, let me find the right button. There we go. Who's, who, who's that? They're throwing bombs and something at me. Get out the stupid rifle. Okay, I'm gonna have to shoot people. Boom, boom. Throw a grenade. Ha ah! ha. I'm just gonna let it blow up. Yeah, you're dead. You're a dead, dumb bitch. What is this, ammo? Police rifle? No, the police rifle isn't as good as this uh, military camo rifle. It really isn't. There's no point. So this music's really kicking off, but I have no idea where Brother Orkin is. I guess we need to work our way up until we find him. Who's shooting at me? Hello? Hello? Are you here? Ah, screw it. I'm gonna keep going up. That's what the marker on my map says is to keep going up. Oh, that's blocked. Well, guess we're not going up anymore. Boom, boom. I could just, like, look through the sights, but the sights are kind of weird and wonky on this game. And it's kind of slow. So I don't really want to look through the sights. It's fine just to hit fire. Don't be mad at me. I know you guys like looking through the sights and all that. Somebody's behind me. I don't know from where, though. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Yeah, no, you don't sneak up on me. Who do you think you are? Oh, God, I actually picked up the rifle. Oh, well. No. Crouch, heal. I still have like over 99 health packs. So I have not wasted too many over the course of this dying like the following playthrough. And we're getting, uh, like I said, really close. We're doing a story quest now and we're 90% of the way through the story. So yeah, again, like one or two more quests ought to do it. This is either the second to last or the last. Brother Orkin is nowhere to be found. Where is he at? There's no more bitches either. Okay, wait, no, there's one. If you look on the radar, it looks like there's one or two over here. The little red dots are popping up. Where are they at? Hello? Nope, not around this corner. It looks like it wants us to go up, but I don't know where to go up. It looks like I just ran around in a complete circle. But this right here is blocked off, so... What do you want from me, game? Oh, I bet this is it. Oh, I bet I got a parkour. Yup, mm-hmm. Usually they, like, label these, uh, what stuff they want you to climb with, like, colors and shenanigans like that, so... Make it pretty noticeable. Usually they're, like, hazard signs, like those black and yellow lines. But I guess this time they just made him just pure freaking red. It's not conspicuous at all. Hey! Where you at? Who's shooting? Oh, there he is. Wow. That's How did you get there? How did you get there, my friend? You're not a zombie. How much armor do you have? Jesus, take a hit, buddy. Get... Oh, oh, yeah. You're dead. You're a dead dumb idiot. This is like back to the days when I played Call of Duty. I did that playthrough. You should go watch that, but it's pretty old. Anyways... Oh no, okay. I thought that grenade was actually, he actually stuck it on there, but he didn't. I think after we kill this guy, it'll be most everyone. Headshot, come on. Get the headshot, get the headshot. How? Dude, die. What, why? What will it take? Okay, thanks, appreciate it. Why? All right, so I made it back up here, but like every time I fall, I guess I have to climb all the way back here. Why are there so many people? I mean, I know the difficulty of this quest is hard, but like, come on. 
There's so many, and they just, they're so good at throwing bombs. I'm gonna waste all my bullets here if I'm not careful. I need to get headshots, though, probably. Headshots will probably do it more than these body shots. If they nail these bombs on this crane again, though, I'm pretty screwed. Like, they can just make them sit there. Like, they don't, like, they don't miss. They, like, land it, and it just, like, balances perfectly there on this rail, and I just die. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Kyle. Oh, don't scare me like that, man. Don't you do it. I'm gonna get some headshots here. One. Stay still. Stay still. You know what? Screw you. Stay still, you bastard. Stay. Okay, there we go. That guy's dead. This guy has a lot of armor. Oh. All right. He's dead. We're good. We got him. He's not coming. Oh. Oh. Kyle, stop almost falling off the fucking crate. Why? You keep doing it every time. Stop. You're scared. You're gonna give me a heart attack, man. Wow, you don't have a head anymore. Get fucked. Oh, you, you're still here, though. You don't have a head anymore either. Ha ha. All right. We got some ammo now, some rifle ammo. There's a guy over there. I don't know if these guys are, like, spawning in or if there are a set amount of guys and they just so happen to be, like, 30 of them. But they're starting to annoy me. They're starting to piss me off. Oh, there's there's one of those bombs. Yep, there they are. Mm-hmm. They have the big grenades, too. They don't have the cheap made grenades that I have. Anyways, I need to get headshots on them or they won't die. It'll take 35 bullets to kill one of them if I don't get a headshot. Oh, wait. I'm going to go at him with the sword. You guys ready? You guys ready? Oh, I'm, I'm freaking insane. I'm a, Oh, God. Yeah, I'm like, there's no way you're not a serial killer when you run at people with Egyptian kopeshes and chop their freaking head off. You're a serial killer at that point if you ever were. So, he may be over here, I'm assuming. I'm assuming he's over here. There's no baddies over here. Freaking orc of the whale. Where you at, man? I need you. God, I got your head. Your head's gone. Oh, they... Man, they took your face away. You don't have... Oh, no, you're just one of those faceless mask people. Barely able to breathe. Weeps oh, silently. Orkin. Kyle. That you? Yes, I'll try to help you. No. Just listen. They're following us. Did Guys. Secure. They nailed him. No. How to help? No, but seriously, he got—he has nails in his face right now. He has nails in his face. Yeah. Okay. Mother, I told them nothing. Dude, you are Don't brave, talk. man. Save You're your a brave soul. Get you out of here. Light house. Light house. You want me to go to a lighthouse? You can stay with me. Damn it. Dude, guys, they took each nail individually. They put one on his face. They took that hammer right there. And they drove it into his face multiple times. Ah, you are you are a brave soul, man. You know what? Rip in peace. GG. You you the real MVP. Alright. That guy got the bad end of a deal. Granary. He got the bad end. Orkin. They captured and tortured him. May the god of the sun accept his soul. Man, you're a bitch. What a cop-out. I don't know. He said he didn't. He did try to tell me something about the cure. I guess they didn't know how to open it. So some of its remains, even though they spilled a lot at that field. That's what I just said, but yeah, Any thanks. Idea where they could have gone? Orkin said something about the lighthouse. I'll take a look. Thank you, brother. If you find those vials, give us a sign immediately. You'll take it straight to the mother. I'm not dealing with a behemoth. It said behemoth, and I said no. I am not dealing with that. Okay, so where's this at? Oh, that's a little far away. So we go to the lighthouse now. What does it say? Get to the lighthouse. Um, yeah, there's nothing else. There's no other new description. So yeah, that guy got tortured, and then he told me to go to the lighthouse. Hopefully we will find this new medicine so we can cure the disease. I believe that's the main goal here. The main part of this story is us finding this stuff that the faceless use to not make the zombies attack people and then maybe using that as a cure of some kind but anyways guys i'm gonna drive over to the lighthouse and i will see you when i get there Kyan, can you hear me? yes lena i hear you lena i copy go ahead no i don't copy that's cheating i don't cheat on my tests lena. i'm a good little angel Kyan. I'm so close. 
So like, uh, our our headquarters in the main game, we're holed up in like basically like a skyscraper. So I guess she means losing other floors and like you know on the skyscraper where we're at, because like the effect did take over the bottom floors. I think that's what she's talking about. I don't know that for sure. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it means though. So that's what Lena's talking about. Again, guys, if you haven't played this game, this game is amazing. Like, go just buy the main game, if not even the expansion, and go play it for yourselves. It's awesome. It's very, very fun. But anyways, we're about here. That guy is a suicide bomber. He's trying to he tried to walk over and blow me up. Didn't work. Didn't work. We're not going to drive all the way up there. I think we're going to get out here and try to wrap our way to the top. All right. Now what do we do? What's left? We're at the lighthouse. The end of all things. This is called At the End of the Tunnel. This may be, this very well may be the last main quest. Anyways, how do we get in here? Is there a front door? Is there a door to the lighthouse? Can we... Hello? No, it's locked. Okay, there was no X prompt to press a button. Alright, well, as with anything on this game, let's try the roof and see if it lets us up there. We gotta parkour our way up there. Now, see, on Rise of the Tomb Raider, if you haven't watched that playthrough, go watch it. I called everything parkour. Like, when I was just climbing a rock, I'm like, alright, we're gonna parkour here because it's easier to label things. But on this game, he pretty much is doing parkour the whole time. This is known as the parkour zombie game, so I'm not really wrong all the time in calling everything parkour. It makes me feel better about myself. Anyways, how do we... How do... How do... How... Oh. Dude... Do... Why? Okay, we gotta wait for our grappling hook to recharge. I tried jumping backwards. I think there's actually a way to jump backwards, as in, like, jump and grab that railing there, but I'm not gonna try that. I'm gonna try to jump back and use the grappling hook and do that. Yes. Professional. Professional. We did it. All right. I knew it was on the top. I knew it. I knew there'd be an entrance. You are about to enter the following finale. This part of the game is played in a single-player mode. You will be able to come back to explore... to exploring... Okay, but yeah, you were able to come back to exploring the countryside after finishing the game and loading the last save. Do you want to continue? Absolutely. We're going to end this here. This is going to be, I guess, the final part. You're the guy from part one. Damn, I could have killed you. Khan, that's me. Turn me loose. Hey, what the fuck? It was you. You're working with Rises Bandits? Where is You're one of them! Where the hell is I should have known! You're crazy! Don't fuck with me, Khan. Where is it? Look, I just live here, alright? I don't know shit about... No, he's Rise. Bandits. He's with Rise. He's with Rise. He's a liar. Yeah. Fuck him up. Hello. <laughs> he's a lying fuck! His bandit gave him away! I'm the wise ass. That's me. I love that name. No need, pal. Just keep your eye on the balcony. Wait, wait, wait. Listen, I know, I know. I went way overboard, but they forced me. They made me do it. Hawkins Group. Where are they heading? Tell me. To the dam. The priest said the entrance was in the dam. Please. <laughs> Fucking done with you. Crane is so awesome. He's Shit. he's all of us as a character. Like, his dialogue is like, I'm fucking done. I'm out. Fuck this. Fuck you. Fuck that. Crane is such a good character. I love Crane. But now it's all kicking off. Fall. Fall. Fall, you dead bitch. Yeah, fall. That's what you get for betraying people and murdering people. Well, I mean, we do it, but we're the good guys. So, fuck you. Okay. What do we do? Airdrop stolen. Get to the lighthouse. We did that. And you door. and you liked him, didn't you? Yeah, just a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. He was kind of funny. Oh god, we're gonna die. I don't. I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready for any of this. We're gonna have to get our assault rifle out, probably. That'd probably be the best course of action. Taking these guys on with weapon, like melee weapons, is very difficult because they. Oh, god damn it! Damn it! Yeah, taking them on with melee weapons is hard because their guns kill you so fast. So you kind of have to stay in cover and kill them with guns as well. So we're gonna try to do that. You gotta get the headshots too, that takes them out in one shot. Even the guys who seem to have like riot shield armor heads or helmets, if you shoot them in the head, it seems to take them out in like one shot, so that's good. And we don't have to worry too much about running out of bullets, because if you walk over their body, you automatically pick up uh, ammo, so that's great. That's a really great thing. If you're doing your playthrough and you're watching mine, I recommend you, uh, yeah, you just stick to shooting them in the head. I wouldn't recommend running at them with blades. I try that sometimes, it does not always work out. 
Who shot at me over here? I don't, oh god, oh god, no, no. And you also want to heal preemptively. You want to like, if they're shooting at you and you think they might take out all your health, go ahead and heal even if you still have over 100 because, I mean, they may they may save your life. They may, they may have killed you otherwise. You don't know. They may just unload on you like this guy over here. Um, okay. No, 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 please. No, please. Kind of like there. That kind of That's kind of like what I was talking about where you need to heal preemptively. I think that's everyone. So take the vials and defeat the bandits. Wasn't that all the bandits? No, this is, this is the bandit. Take him out. The vials must be up here. I didn't even pay attention to our objectives. I was just focused on killing them and staying alive. Ah, 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 I'm staying alive. Staying alive. Oh, they must be in this car, maybe? I don't know. I don't know if they're in this car. Let's check the trunk and see if they're in there. Nope, that's duct tape. That is definitely not vials. But thanks, game. Appreciate it. Glad you're here for me. <laughs> oh, are these the vials? Oh, okay. We found them. They're right here. I'm stupid. It was They were in an open container the whole time. I looked all around here. I could not find them. Okay, so we did that. What's next? What's next? Tell me. This is Crane. Do you copy? The vials are gone. I saved only the last few of them. And Rise's men are coming to you. Do you hear me? Crane. Come here fast. Come quickly. Low. Shit. Better hurry. Better hurry. All right, so now... Get to the damn entrance before the bandits. Yeah, I doubt that's gonna happen before the bandits, but I'll tell you what, we'll go there nonetheless. So, oh, what is this guy doing? Man, you thought you'd get the drop on me. You were gonna be sneaky, but no, you're not sneaky anymore. This guy too? What are you doing? Man, one day I'm gonna hit you, and when I do, you're gonna die. This guy too? And you, what, like, why do you guys even keep attacking me? I've murdered so many people, and in the main game, spoiler, it's been out a year, go play it, I killed Rise. So, like, what are you people doing? Like, come on. What's going on here? How far away is that, by the way? How far away is that? Oh, God, that is very far. All right, well, let me kill these people one sec. Oh, uh, yes. And yes. So, unless anything really very interesting happens along the way, I'm going to go ahead and make my way towards their place, and I will see you guys when I get there. Oh, movie moment. Oh man. Oh, we're busting through. Oh, we made it. Okay. We're very close to the dam now, I think. Where is it on our map? We're being timed, though. We It's a possibility that we won't even make it, but we'll see. I need to take the next right turn on this road right here. Yes. Oh man, it has been a very eventful run. You guys should have seen the stuff I've been doing on this run here. I mean, all kinds of stuff's been kicking off. They're shooting RPGs at me. It's crazy. But anyway, we're pretty close to the dam now. I wonder if this rain is actually scripted. Um... We need to go to the left a little bit more. I want to go this way, on this little path, and get to the dam. I think we're going to beat the timer. We have a minute and a half left, but I think we can make it. I think we can get there just in the nick of time. Um, are Rise's men going to be here? If they're not, then I need to use a sword. If they are, I need to use a weapon, like a gun. But I don't think they're going to be here. So, we're in a safe zone. There's nobody here so far. I think we need to make our way inside the dam, but I don't know. Do we go up there? Is that, is that an elevator? Where are we... Is this... How do we... Hold up, hold up, hold up. Yeah, we want to go this way, it looks like. It's looks like it's what it's saying, is go up. All right, going up we are. It looks like we already made it. Why is the timer still going? Screw you, timer. We already made it here. What the freak out? What are you talking about? Man, that grappling hook is such a clutch. We might not have made it if we had to climb the whole way up, but we used the grappling hook, and that, that really saved us. All right, I'm waiting for you. Let's see what they have for us.